everyone, this is Jenny Streetview with Confessions of a Hairstylist. And I'm so excited because I have Angel here with me and she has this gorgeous, really, really long hair. So I wanna show you guys how to do some really fun mermaid braids. So this is gonna be a part of my braid series for spring and summer. So let's go and get started. Okay, so to start this look off, what we're gonna do is we're gonna create a triangle section. So I'm just going a couple inches away from the hairline and then taking another section from that tip of the triangle to the hairline. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna split the hair in three sections. And you wanna make sure that your section is really nice and combed out. You don't want any kind of flyaways or any frizzes because that's gonna really um, mess up our braid. So now we're just gonna divide that section in three. and we're gonna be doing a simple French braiding technique. We're gonna take the left side up and over into the middle, and now right side up and over to the middle. Now we wanna start putting the sections on the right side over to the right. So I'm just gonna simply drape that across, clip that for now with my hair clip. Now I'm gonna take my pinky finger, grab a little bit of hair underneath it, and that is gonna be our new right-handed section. So now I'm gonna take that, the left side go into the middle, our right side go into the middle. Now that section over to the right, we're gonna put it into the clip and grab onto another piece of hair. So we're adding hair as we go. So now that left side is into the middle, right side is into the middle. Taking that right side, putting it into our clip, adding a little bit of hair from underneath, taking that left section, going over into the middle, that right section over into the middle. We're just gonna continue that same pattern. Now that we've gotten to the middle of her head, a little bit below her crown, almost to where her occipital bone is, we're just going to continue to do a simple three-stranded braid. All right, so now we're gonna create a triangle section on the opposite side, so her hairline, a couple inches away from our hairline um, in the front here. Now we're just gonna do the same thing, but instead of adding hair, we're gonna grab onto the hair on the opposite side. So what I mean by that is we're gonna go ahead and take our three sections, do a simple French braiding technique. So right goes into the middle. Now our left section, we're gonna grab onto a piece of hair from the opposite side. So now we're gonna add a little bit of hair to our right section, draping that piece across, making a pass into the middle, taking our right section into the middle. So now that we've gotten to our last piece, we're just gonna go ahead and continue doing a simple three-stranded braid. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna go ahead and pull gently on each side, just kind of evening it out and stretching the hair. That's gonna make her braid seem a lot fuller and thicker. Now I'm just gonna take the end of my weaving comb and kind of pull some of these guys down so they're nice and even on each side. All right, so what I've done now is I went ahead and clipped away her sections for later. We're gonna go and incorporate those in just a second. So what we're gonna do is go ahead and create a normal fishtail braiding uh, technique. So I'm gonna split the hair in half. Then we're gonna take a small section of hair from our right side going up and over to the left. Now we're gonna do the same thing on the opposite side, taking a small piece of hair from the left side going up and over to our right. We're gonna continue that all the way down to the ends and go, I'm going to go ahead and secure that with, a, with an elastic. Now I'm getting close to the ends and I'm just gonna go ahead and secure it with an elastic. All right, so now what I'm gonna go ahead and do next is I'm just gonna go ahead and connect these two braids together. And what I like to do is simply just pinch them together and underneath bobby pin them. So I do this by feel and I take my bobby pin going downwards and I just kind of weave it in and out, in and out, going all the way down. 
So I'm gonna do a couple of these. So one through in the top here. Then I'm going to go ahead and do another one here closer to the ends. So now I'm gonna connect both of them by using a hairpin and simply just apply it in the braid and then all the way through to the other side and just weave it back and forth and push it down so that connects them both. Just gonna do a little bit of detailing out. Connect the ends with an elastic. All right, so there you guys have it. A really gorgeous, fun mermaid braid, perfect for spring and summertime. So basically, this is like a half corset braid on top of a fishtail braid, really pulled out. So Angel has really gorgeous long hair, but you can definitely um, utilize the same technique on mid-length hair if you'd like to. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Feel free to check me out on Instagram, at the Confessions of a Hairstylist, and follow me on Twitter, Facebook, I got it all. It's just the links are gonna be below, and I'll see you guys soon.